Hey everybody, welcome back, it's Nerdicus, <clears throat> here with a uh, new game called Gunfire Reborn. Now this game is an adventure level based game featured with FPS, roguelite, and RPG. Players can control heroes with various abilities to experience diverse build gameplay, use random dropped weapons to explore random levels. This game can be played by single player or co-op up to four. So, essentially what this is, is this a roguelike shooter. That's, and I don't know if you guys have ever seen me play a shooter, so we'll, we'll see, uh, <laughs> we'll see how good I am, but there's multiple heroes, uh, well maybe there's just two, for now, this game isn't really access, but there's tons of weapons to unlock right now, um, honestly, like, all I can really do is just go into the game for you guys to show you what it is. <coughs> So I did do one run yesterday just to kind of see. Now should oh I gotta be at least level 10 for matchmaking. So let's we're soloing it, which is I guess okay. It's probably how it should be since uh, that's honestly kind of good that they're doing it like that. They're forcing you to play at least some uh, offline play to get the skills down before you hop onto online. I respect that to be honest. I could really get behind it. Chest need to activate the talent arm support. Sad. Okay, well, this is it. <laughs> I hope this game runs and looks well for you guys on uh, recording when I post this. I'm honestly, I'm kind of tempted to start streaming again, but my rate is not going to look good. Uh, my bit rate is going to be... But yeah, so these enemies are also shooters. Not now. Alright. So. Ninja invincibility. For each second your hero doesn't deal weapon damage to an enemy, 10% weapon damage up to 50%. Nice. And then Argus. This is my favorite. This is a crossbow that shoots arrows in a straight line. Kind of like the, uh, uh, the first weapon you get. Uh, not finding Isaac. Uh, dead space. Hello. Now, so you notice that at the bottom left, I do have a counter for my ammo. So this weapon does take special ammo. My normal pistol that I give you does not and has infinite. So the triple comeback max HP and max shield will cut in half. But you gain two instant revives. This ocular, oculate scroll is destroyed after the second revive. Max and HP go back to normal as well. Hell yeah. That is awesome. If it goes back to normal, <coughs> why not? So I have the ability to destroy the, the walls. Unlock that. But um, just make sure this room's empty. Okay. Yeah, let's go. Um, let's go check that room out. What's this like? Hold on. Where's the music at? I can barely hear it. Oh. All right. Whatever. <laughs> Some quick work on these boys. Argus. Ah! Ah! Plus, this thing has huge knockback, so it's nice for those guys that rush you like them. Spear throwers. The swordmen. Ah! Woo! No sad. No bombs for me. <laughs> You're jumping headshotted. So, first chest that we've been able to open in our scroll, bluff, 25% damage dealt when your health is full HP. Nice. So, I don't remember how to use this stuff, to be honest with you. Kind of forgot. I'm assuming that they're just uh, passives that I have. So, this is the vault, too. Alright, well, let's move on. We got his vault, and... Hit the exit. Oh, heavy box crossbowmen. This thing's, this thing's OP, the Argus. Ah! Oof! Hello. But I don't want to use all my ammo right now, but I'm probably gonna have to. Get wrecked, sure. 
Okay, goblet. So this game kind of has like uh, abilities like this. So you choose an ascension path, and they're kind of random from what I've noticed. So enemies uh, affected by smoke grenades die explode after dying. Energy orb freezes enemies for two additional seconds. That'd be kind of nice. Corrosion damage. I'll go with that. My orb is my uh, third ability. And what that does now is, like I said, if it hits an enemy, it does damage, locks them down. Very useful for people that are charging. Ow. Of course it didn't hit anybody there. Oh boy! Wow. Man's almost just killed me. How splendiferish. Um, let's go to the ball. Hopefully we can get something that increases my max health, but I also do have free revives. How dare you? Yeah, I like that. So I do have a dash kind of thing. Except I got lit on fire anyways. Oh boy, oh boy. <clears throat> They're putting in some serious damage on me here. Get rid of the crossy guys first. I gotta worry about this guy. Damn it. Let me get around my shield. Go around him. Yeah. Okay, so nowhere else in here. Yes, 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 yes. The ammo capacity is doubled. No way, dude. That is fantastic. Could not be happier. Nice, nice throw, dude. Ooh. I didn't even see that passive explosive device here. Ah! Jump scare me. Who do you think you are? Oh, I do have these too. I gotta start using those smoke grenades. The uh, spies do that. Oh, get out! Ah! I'm getting rushed. I only have one weapon, which is kind of sad. But I found a second ball. Alright, after you use a smoke grenade, max HP. Oh, gain. Nice, that'd be cool. Energy orb has one more charge. Energy orb has a 50% chance of exploding twice. 30% is three times. Yeah! Let's try it. <laughs> let's get crazy. And let's hopefully get a uh, third weapon. Challenge event is the risk that may appear at any time in the adventure, but it also means unexpected goods. All enemies transform into the horn beetle after being defeated. Okay. Easy. Okay. Oh! I didn't even see that poison grenadier up there. Yum! Too evasive for you. Ooh. Too evasive. Whoa, whoa, oh, I forgot, they turned into horn beetles. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Challenge succeeded. So what do I get? Point, minus 0.5 damage taken for every... Cool. That's nice. And I think that's it in here, so... Forward. There we go, piercing flame. I did like this one. It's a good way to engage the dis or engage the room from a distance. I can kill at least. I thought it was pretty cool. But the Longling Tomb. Ah! That's not how I wanted to turn a corner and see. Taking some serious damage and not going down. 
out of my way, peasant. Oh! <laughs> What's up? <laughs> Just lurking in the corner. Wild hunt. Pressing down and releasing the fire button will trigger individual shots. Okay. Hmm. More scorching rounds. I kind of liked, uh, if I could, let's go with the Aura of Venom. I did like this one a lot. And then I'm trading out the Sniper for the Argus. This crossbow is insane. Just having a knockback is much. And having a, essentially three headshots in one. 50% lucky shot chance for two seconds after using a dash. Okay, so, increase crit. Is that crit or that would be the... Is that what that would be? Yeah, that's crit. So, when I dash, get 50% crit. Um, craftsman. So, enhance my weapon's damage. Boost my Argus, man. I want this thing to destroy. Ah! chest chat may you maybe you might need any help of course this doesn't come for free uh hp is fine obtain gold lose 14 hp you get 108 gold sure i have a free revive anyways right i think i still do that Don't know. where is it Yeah, I have two instant revives, so I have one more still left over. down there. Jeez. That was not an easy room. But, um, is that... That's really that way. Another goblet. Enemies affected by smoke, grenades explode after dying, energy orb freeze enemies for four seconds or after killing an enemy. I don't think I have any elemental effects other than decay. So let's just go with smoke and start actually using them. Any enemy that crosses into my smoke that dies in it will be an explosive device now. <laughs> uh oh. Ah! I walked right into it. I love myself. Oh, thank you. Ah, nice, Chief. Love that. I'm so bad at this game still. It's a nice learning curve to it. Is there anybody up here? Ah! 
I didn't realize I was sitting behind an explosive barrel. Ah, fantastic. Killing me. Oh, we're not done yet. I'm in a bad spot. Is there anybody back here? Okay. It's only this direction that they're coming from. Die. Whoa! Where did you come from, mate? That's it. Is this a lightning SMG? It is. Mm. Yeah, I'll roll this one over that, why not? Show you guys a nice showcase of the weapons. Try this out in this uh, area up here. It's vault. What we got? What goodies are you gonna give me this time? So the, not really what's well, good, but not what I want. Gain immunity to all damage after one second after swapping weapons. <laughs> oh my god. That's kind of cool, though. I'm gonna get hit pretty hard. I can just. Bloop. 
But yeah, I'm gonna take this SMG over that. It's good, but it's not what I want. Oh, I didn't realize we're at the the boss. <laughs> well, Paddler, what you got? Cavalry, three burst rifle, plus two, plus two. Hawkeye, 100% crit axe, however, 50% weapon damage. Minus percent when not hitting the weakness. What? So I have to hit where, I'm assuming that, well, let's try it out. I'm assuming that it's gonna say like, I have to hit the target in a certain area. Or it's gonna show where I have to hit. Let's get some health back. And then what can we do with this guy? It's a free message G. So, I'll hold the active much better. I should have a spot where I can hit my target and do critical damage. This guy is a monster. Whoa, I was gonna say, where's he going? He just picked up speed out of nowhere. Money to revive! Haha! -ha. Except I really didn't want to have to revive because I feel like it's kind of cheating. And I'm still gonna get destroyed. Yeah. Oh my god. All for nothing. Yeah. All for nothing, man. Jesus. Ha! <sighs> that sucks. Almost 500 or 5,000 health. So there's three stages. Well. Wow. Oh yeah, and at the end, uh, any money you have left over, you can use to upgrade your character. So I'm gonna start to upgrade my skills like this. Shield health. And then you can't use anything else there. So that's essentially the game. You unlock new abilities as you go. It's a first person shooter. Uh, early access, so it's still cheap and it's on sale through Steam sale. Um, highly would recommend this game. And there's multiplayer, so why not? But, hope you guys enjoyed it, and I definitely hope you guys look into this, and if you guys are interested in playing, feel free to comment below. I would love to play with somebody that enjoys these videos, if they do. So, uh, hope you guys have a good day, and uh, hope to see you in the next one.